I'm making a short this short video today um, because some people are new to what I'm sharing uh, some people are not and I just want to keep this very simple I might sound like I'm repeating myself because I've shared this message many times I've been traveling around Australia sharing this message but 2020 I have been sharing more about what the establishment do more about their rituals occult practices so on and so forth okay and I'm noticing that people are still replying to the things I'm sharing which obviously I take my responsibility in this I'm sharing information that is hard for many people okay but I'm still seeing people res reply with anger. Still having a, having a go with anger, calling these people scum of the earth, vile, blah, 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 blah. And I get it. Look, I get it. I totally get it. But we have to understand how the field works. What you say does have meaning. Because whether you write it with spelling, spell, okay, or whether you say it, words carry a message that go into the field. But the, the main thing how the field communicates with us and we communicate with it is actually through what we feel, okay? So the word, if you're feeling like, the information I've shared, which I'm sorry, this is my role in it, and I take full responsibility. If I've shared something that's, that's made you angry, I'm not saving you, okay? I'm creating karma for myself and for the world. Because the information's coming in, <clears throat> it's disrupting your information field, and then you are offering anger to the field, or you are saying negative, harmful words into the field. And I'm sorry to say this, but it's the truth. You are not contributing to the solution. And neither am I. And if, if, if people keep doing it, I'm just going to stop sharing it. Because I, we are not contributing to the solution. We are contributing to the problem. It's the truth. Because anger, fear... Anxiety, hatred is what makes this world hell on earth. If those things were eliminated from human nature, you'd see heaven on earth because nature is beautiful. It doesn't need anything. It's naturally beautiful. This is why you see a sunrise, you climb a mountain, you go to a waterfall. There's, you just see beauty because it's beautiful. Okay, And it's like that everywhere in the world. If it hasn't had... An influence of hate, fear, anger, and so on. So, I'm calling you, please. <clears throat> I always try and speak in solutions. If I have just give this information angrily, and I say, this is what these people are doing, blah, 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 and then just leave it, okay? You, it's going to hit you that way. And then there's going to be a resistance. And that, you don't even know, it's a natural resistance, I hope I'm not sharing it that way. My whole point is we have to understand spiritual wisdom of compassion. Compassion allows us to see the suffering in the world and understand the suffering of those that are creating suffering. Then when information like what I'm sharing comes to you, there's only love for all involved. And it's a heart opening because you commit to bring in peace. That way, when you get that information, you go into forgiveness. Please forgive me for any contribution I've ever made in any lifetime towards the suffering for me to be. And I'm sorry. I forgive all beings. I love you all. All souls join together as one. Or all souls forgive each other. It's a mantra that my teacher shares. It's beautiful. I forgive you. It means forgive everyone. Please forgive me. Asking for forgiveness. All souls forgive each other. 
putting that into the field, it's a, a it's asking all souls to forgive each other and join as one. Bring love, peace, harmony. Universal love, universal peace, universal harmony. So powerful, so simple. But this is the response. It's not pointing the finger and this, that, you vile, you blah, blah, blah. You know what they say? You go like this. You got one finger pointing at the person you're blaming. One finger pointing up to heaven or God. You've got three fingers pointing back at yourself. Okay? So we don't point the finger. We open the heart. If my information is closing your heart and bringing you up here and making you angry, just unfollow me or message me and I will stop sharing this information. I believe, the only reason I've decided to share this after 10 years is I believe now is a very important time to see what's been going on. 2020, we haven't got longer 2020 left. I might, I'm gonna stop after 2020. I believe we need to see it so we can understand the suffering, move into the heart and then contribute and move towards the solution please choose love please forgive more please look deeper in your meditations into the nature of compassion and understand and that's when we bring light to the world it's not light versus dark it's consciousness it's enlightenment enlightenment it's bringing a light a spiritual understanding to this beautiful uh, situation we're in remember what we're in is beautiful we should be so empowered so grateful to be here this is the most fertile ground for individual and collective enlightenment please stay in love please stop <coughs> commenting on my post saying vile the sickening it, it, it is don't get me wrong it is terrible practices but we have to grow out of them we have to grow and mature and evolve consciously out of them and move from fear, which is mind, separation, into love, which is unity and, and, and oneness. I love you all. Take care. Bye-bye.